Okay, so let's graph this linear equation y equals 4x plus 7. We're going to use a table of values to do that. You could also use slope-intercept form, and that would work as well, give you the same graph. If you need help with that, link at the end of the video. So we're going to put values in for x, figure out what we get, and that'll give us y. Then we'll graph it. Let's start out with, say, we could say 0, because 4 times 0, that's 0, plus 7, that gives us 7. How about we just choose 1? I'm just making these numbers up. Here, if I said 4 times 1, that's 4. 4 plus 7 is 11, and that would go off my graph. So I don't want to do that. I think what I want to do is make it negative 1. 4 times negative 1, that's negative 4. Negative 4 plus 7 gives me 3. That'll fit nicely. Then I'll do negative, how about, how about negative 2? 4 times negative 2, that's negative 8 plus 7. That gives us negative 1. So now we can graph these points for this equation here. y equals 4x plus 7. x, that's 0. y is 7 right there. That's our first point. Then we go to x is negative 1, y is 3. Negative 1, 3. You could do it with just two points. I like to have three, though, make sure I didn't have any problems. x is negative 2. And then y, that is negative 1 right there. You can see our line. Let's put a line through that. Then we'll put arrows to show it goes to infinity. That's the graph for y equals 4x plus 7. And you could put any value in for x, then get your value for y. And when you plot that somewhere, it would be here on the line. That's it. It's Dr. B graphing y equals 4x plus 7. Thanks for watching.